All right, so parts and uh, was it electric? No. What was the other? <sighs> Shoot, I can't remember now. At least he's pretty healthy, this guy. It's a rat. Gotta try from the other side. All right. So that's how you change between combat and... Huh. Come on, man. There's got to be food. if there's anything in this place I didn't know someone was here yeah, hey go back to sleep <laughs> All right, it's a bunch of components I guess you can never really have too much of these These guys still inside here? They are. Shoot. Private property. Oh, it says it. No, of course not. Shoot, dude, we need the... Oh wait, it says it's locked, but... says we can force it with one of our tools. Wait, did we just unequip the... saying that I can't open it. Alright, man. Well, I guess we're almost dead. Do 
Did we go up all the way up here yet? Can we kill the rat and make like food out of it? Or no? Oh. I guess I never came up this way. like no parts here. Oh, parts. <laughs> Gotta leave this place fast. Wait, why? stealing from them oh shoot oh run 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 run, run. go back that's much left I gotta go back all right we're going we're going day 12 I'm plenty of real, real fine stuff. What a night. We've been raided. Great. Renault's feeling much better. We just need to keep an eye on him. Some ugly looking ruins. It seems serious. She upset. Yeah, she's depressed. And he is too. Keep hitting us, they'll eventually wear us down. <sighs> Hug it out. I'm supposed to survive if thugs are trying to kill me and take my things. We need help without bandages will be bleed to death. We need to make sure we can defend our shelter, otherwise we're done for. I need to find some bandages tonight. I can't fail my friends. As if the war and shortage of bandages wasn't supplies was enough, someone came to rob us. That's good. Dude, he is like powering through this thing. If we lost Pale, we lost everything. <laughs> Actually. Alright, man. You gotta try to see if we can upgrade this. Slightly sick. All right, you go take some bandages then. Oh, we still need two parts. He's very tired. Shoot, dude. Oh my god, this is so bad. Make one. How is she? On meds? Okay. Alright, you go talk with him.
All right, this, this dude needs to rest. He's so tired. Hungry, slightly sick, severely wounded, sad. Okay. Wounded, depressed. Dude, I don't know who to send out tonight. Oh wait, do we still need to talk with him? Let's make another bed. We really need another one. Everybody rests tonight. We have no food. And he's very hungry, she's hungry, and he's hungry. He's recovering. If he gets better, then we might be able to send him out tonight. Alright. Hostile. <laughs> right, let's have everyone rest. Hungry, slightly sick, on med, severely wounded. Alright, you're sleeping in bed. Hungry, sad, tired. Uh, hungry, wounded, depressed. All right, you're going to go on guard tonight. We can't go out. It wasn't a good night. I was overcome with grief and couldn't sleep, so I was trying to console him. I was feeling much better, so we have to keep an eye on him. Some ugly, they seem very serious. Are there any animals left in the city? I'm hungry. I'd even eat a rat or a pigeon. City was used to welcome everybody with open arms. I love the old town. If we make it through, I do as much as I can to remember how it was because we accomplished a lot. We just stand together. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Everyone is depressed. Oh, man. I don't know if this is going to be a good ending. Why do they, they always get on the ground and get up? Now he is talking through it. Top tips to survive. Craft an axe. You'll start out with a burp workbench, but gathering the correct supplies will allow you to build another that specializes in various tools and basic weapons. An axe, take inventory. We tend to spend a lot of awful time uh, by knowing what exactly we need, say, for board up the place. One of the best moves we ever made was board up their shelter as quickly as possible. Doing so is m minimize the amount of bandits that get in, save a lot. Plus, bandits, you can even make the process easier by taking our advice in the first tip in this of this article. Oh. Uh, so. Like the axe and stuff. Okay, I see. Having it available in your home will mean additional space for backpack, other more vital items while out scavenging. Okay, so you kind of want to do the workbench like first. Two rodent traps. You may not want to think about eating rat meat, but trust us, we tell you that it's your best bed for sustainable food. Rodent traps will give you two rats every two or so days. People often complain that there is shortage on these goods, but they are far better for trading when they are, they are drinking and smoking. Set up moonshine rig in our home. They tried to pump out at least one bottle a day. Uh, build two heaters. The game starts off you with one heater, but it's not enough to keep the place sufficiently warm, and we're almost going to be dealing with illness right after get-go. 
This is a case how they consider building at least one or, or more heater, possibly two. Winter water. Cook your food aside from obvious benefits. We we'll actually save it from being stolen by bandits, huh? Go visit a doctor. It took us until our third playthrough to go do it through a uh, visit of the hospital, but once we did, we found there's a doctor roaming around there, and as long as you don't get caught stealing, the soldiers won't mess with you. This will come in extremely handy during the warm winter months, and when people are sick, or if they are wounded while out scavenging, just have the less than healthy person visit the doctor, keeping in mind that you would cause trouble or you have passed, they will remember and possibly kill you. So, hospital. Oh man, this guy's about to pass up, stand, pass out, standing up. He just said there's no point anyway. These guys are like so close to forming a suicide pack. Honestly. All right, we're gonna try to send uh, who's very severely wounded. We're gonna try to send Katia to the hospital or whatever it is. What was that thing called? visit of the hospital but once we did we found there's a doctor roaming around and as long as you don't get caught stealing soldiers won't mess with you so if you don't steal from places with people there or like if there's scavengers it seems like if there's scavengers around they'll tell you whether you can steal or not if they're like get out of here then uh you better run it sounds like I really messed up by not upgrading the workbench, like, right away, though. Uh, I will be right back. I'm gonna grab some water real quick, because my throat's feeling a little dry. Alright, I'm back. So, I just tried a few tips to help me out. I think this, pe this playthrough is gonna be pretty bad. Um, but we'll see what happens. It was my first run, so I looked into some tips, and uh, hopefully, hopefully, it helps. So it's saying wait until people are very tired and very hungry until you do stuff. This guy is so wounded, man. All right, now you talk to him, because he is depressed. But yeah, I really messed this up. <laughs> it's hard, but we're in this together. I I know, but all this... It's too much for me. So, prioritize really making this, the rainwater, and the stove but also upgrading this. Makes me want to restart, but I, I'm uh, not going to, because I want to, I want to finish this one however it ends. So if she's good at bargaining, Oh, she should be the one that always answers the door. Right, I forgot. And he's a fast runner, so he's good at going places, and Bruno's a good cook. So... Does he actually have, like... Okay. Like, if you get your hands on this, hand me a And who knows how long this war is going to last. Severely wounded and tired. What's he? All right, let's have her get in bed. Wait. Very hungry. The 
the night. Very hungry, wounded, and sad. Alright, you can guard. Severely wounded. We're going to take her to the... Is the hospital available? Small apartment building. City hospital. Yeah, we're going there. Um... Caution advise. Okay. Very hungry, sad, tired. We'll have him guard too. Uh, yeah, yeah. They're not very tired, so that's fine. Um, I don't think we're gonna take anything. We'll just have her go there. Supposedly, there's a doctor. Uh oh. Still loading. Okay. Yo, what up, Dev? They say it still operates. Doctor, please. I just want to see a doctor. Please. I don't make any trouble. I'm not going to from the damage report. Let me know if you need something, Doc. I need, I need help. I'm, I'm injured. Please. Last shelling was worse. I hope this helps. Okay, so I think that icon is steel, but the rest is like scavenge. So like when you have the hand icon thing, my stream keeps buffering, does it? Like the field hospital built on the ruins. Just left, I don't blame them. If it gets worse, I'll be here to help you. Thank you. I've got to have food or something, right? I'm not stealing from them. Holy crap. Nope. Does this count as stealing? If I go through the rubble? I don't think it does. I think it's just scavenging. Yeah. Doc, please. We've lost so many patients. Don't need my help. Oh, okay. Fine. Wow, there's a lot of doctors here. Holy crap. more minutes and I can eat cake. <laughs> I'll be just in time to say happy birthday. So that I'm just realizing now that that icon is, are you a patient? Yeah, pretty much. Oh man. 
Evening, are you here to donate medical supplies? I need food. Please. Help. Help me. Cigarette. Oh, wait. I know one person that would love to have that. Can... Wood? Is that okay? I can't give you food, sorry man. If you can't help us, why are you bothering me? I... well... I... 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 sorry. Alright. Well, I, I feel a lot more confident now that we know we can do any of these. Alright, let me just check these. And then uh, that's pretty much all we can get here. But at least we got some food. Okay. Let me check this one. Why are there bad people? Can't we all just get along in this community for 80 days, right? <laughs> it's just some very, very bad people. But these guys aren't too bad, actually. Got my eyes on you? Hey, man, that's all right. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not trying to steal from the hospital. I right, run to exit. At least we got bandaged for free. So that's nice. If only there was a place that was that had free food. <laughs> Let me check this. Uh, we're almost out of time anyways. Nice. Oh my gosh. So worth checking that. Alright, take me home. Country road. Katia is back. Day 14. Sketchy. You've been raided. Someone came at night. Oh god. Bruno is bleeding. It looks like he won't make it. Pava is starving. We must find him some food. You have to keep an eye on her. Oh my god. Everybody, everybody's depressed. Everybody wants... Oh my god. It's so bad. Who's starving? Okay, so he's starving. And he's very tired. Are we watch World War Z today? Getting those apocalypse vibes? <laughs> I can see that. She's very hungry, too. They both gotta eat something. Alright, actually, let's make her go down here first. So I looked up some... some tips for this, and I knew... I, for the most part, I know where I went wrong, but, man... This is... not a... not going to be a happy ending, whatever happens. There's still missing parts, man. I'd say these are quite nutritious. Very hungry. Is she? She's very hungry. He's very hungry. Alright, let's do. Oh, wait. He just ate two. He's very tired. She needs to be talked to. How the hell do we get raided if the people are on security? Well, I think last night. So, there's a few things that I messed up. I didn't upgrade the place enough, so I can't board up things. Uh, so basically everything here is like, like SOL. So like normally you can board up like your windows and stuff, but now I'm so late into the game, 14 days, or we're literally getting raided like every two nights. It's pretty bad. 
lethally wounded. All right, tonight I'm taking this guy to uh, that hospital to see if they can help. And we have a lot of days left. I don't know how many days there are in this. I don't. It might be 20, but I know it can go up to like 40 or 80. So it's it can be a lot. Damn thieves, as if we didn't have it hard enough. Don't let me bleed to death. Dress my wounds, please. She's doing a lot better. The situation is dire. We need food. That's it. My friends are getting bandages, even if I have to steal them from someone. My friends are starving while I'm not. It's not right. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Alright, have him go talk to that guy. She's very tired. Alright, you get you get some sleep. She's starving. Be easier to move a smaller place so you wouldn't have as much hard time defending with few people. Right. Um I don't know if you can like I wanna look up can you recruit people? Like, can you add? Uh, what's it called? Um, my recruit. Can't be certain it's rent since it's revenized, but no, it's not an opportunity thing. It's possible for another person to come and ask to join. Though I think once you reach four people, you won't get any more recruits. That's max. Okay, thanks. It's max, but I've had five people in the house before. Why did you reject? He's the best fighter, best guard. Anyway, the max for the recruits seem to be five, and new recruits always randomly come, but they will be less often when you have three plus characters. Okay, Let's see. Each person has like their own good skills too. All right, you need to get some sleep, my guy. He's very tired. He's very hungry. Can you make at least one? Let's see. If he can make at least make one meal, that'll help us a lot for him and then we just need to worry about her but I'm not sure Fuck. <laughs> okay we'll make we should be able to <laughs> alright we can at least make one at least it's not like a fallout shelter popping out babies left and right. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, and then have him eat. Wait, 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 wait. Is she starving? She's very hungry too. Okay. And he's very hungry. Alright, alright. Yeah, you can eat. I wouldn't mind another helping. Yeah, dude, I know. Lethally wounded. Is anyone sick? She's wounded, but she's recovering. He's depressed, hungry, and very tired. Okay, let's end it for the day. All right, so... I'm tired, very tired, so he's gotta, he's gotta sleep. Honestly, at this rate, guarding does literally nothing, so she's gonna sleep too. No! I can't even take him to the place! Aw, oh, dude. 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 He's gonna die. I thought I was gonna be able to take him to the hospital. I can't even do that. He's 100% going to die. Oh my god, dude. Lots of food, meds. We've got nothing to look for there. The quiet house. How about here? Small apartment. We can try to steal or take them by force. What about the brothel? A danger, possible threat. 
Dude, whatever. At this rate. Who do we take though? She's wounded. He's wounded. Do we have everybody sleep? If everybody sleeps, then we're not gonna get anything. <laughs> oh my god. He's very tired. Alright, well, we gotta take her. I'm taking her to the brothel. It's my first time in this kind of place. Listen, I'm just here for some materials, that's all. I just want to scavenge, that's all. said there might be some meds here. It's trash mostly among corners if someone had ripped it. Traces of what? What did it say? That's barring whoever Tossy here wasn't their owner. We have no extra inventory space at all. All I know is I can't wait to redo this. I think if they don't die tonight, then tomorrow I'm going to restart it. Alright, so we got some parts, which is good, in the least. Is a thing called Amazon Blacksmith? Yeah, dude. I love that thing. <laughs> it's pretty cool, too, because, like, of course, like, of course, buy your games where you want, but, like, if somebody uses Amazon, like, if you click on it, and then, like, say there's an item or something, and you buy it, I get like a, a small percentage. Looks like, are they willing to trade? They are. Listen, man, I need some meds. It's going to cost her a lot. Listen, I will give you everything I have. Everything. Everything. How about weapons? You want parts? You want anything? Come on, man. Please. <sighs> Shoot. It will cost you. Shoot. I wish I brought something to trade. <sighs> Never mind. Hey man, I just want I just want to trade. This is our place. Leave. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Sorry. Don't try this. Okay. Okay. Sorry. So most of the places, they still have stuff that you can take. It's just like whether you go all the way inside or not. Okay. Wait, can we get up there? Wait, is this possible? No way. Yo, she's wild.
I'm not going any further than this door. Maybe I am. Okay. Never mind. Uh, uh, one more. If we can get up there. She is like... Dying right now so badly. All right, run the exit. Run. At least she's just wounded and it's not like severely wounded anymore. Does she blink? Does her picture blink? Oh, it does. <laughs> I just realized that. I don't know if we could get up there anyways. Can we get down here? We could, but there's nothing. Okay. We can't get through that thing at least. All right, get out of here, man. Katia is back. Loading. Curious how the game will end besides everyone dying. I think they can survive, most of them. And I got a re really good haul. Look at what I got. We've been raided, of course. Bruno died from severe wounds. <laughs> R.I.P. Bruno. That was a terrible night. Bruno died from severe wounds. Someone tried to rob us. <laughs> Pablo is feeling better. We just need to keep an eye on him. We just need to keep an eye on him means that he's very depressed. Hey, man. R.I.P. Bruno. Next time they'll break through. It's pointless. Can't let any more of our friends die, even if it means taking someone else's supplies. Look at Katia. She's miserable. How long is it since she last ate? Bruno's death shows us, shows we are weak. We must make sure no one else dies. I'm getting weaker each day. I'm starving. Oof. <laughs> you horrible person. Why are they sitting? I can't do anything. Uh-oh, they're both broken. Uh-oh. Humans.exe has stopped working. Oh no. It says, it literally says broken. Dude, Pavlov, you're doing fine. Or Pavli. Come on, man. We can we can survive. He's he's hungry and he's broken, but we can do this. Oh no, dude. I think we might be stuck. We we literally might be stuck. Dude, if he if he has the mental capacity to get up, we can get out of this. Literally, because he's well rested, he's just hungry, he's not tired, like everything with him is fine now. Why did he have to die? Dude, they are fully. Uh oh. Alright. I don't think they'll do anything. Depressed, depressed. Oh no. It's a never ending. I can't do anything. 
We've been raided. Someone came in. Paula left the shelter. Left during the night. We don't think he'll be back. Katia is bleeding. It looks like she won't make it. Dear God. We were off. We're better off without Paula, anyways. Pavle. Whatever. His name was. As if the war is shorter. As game last night and robbed us. Let's hope you survive here. Wait, is she like our our only hope now? Can we even do anything? He was literally our only hope. Why'd it have to be him? Uh oh. Yeah, dude, happy birthday. <laughs> Like Kiara. Kiara. <laughs> Oops. Blood everywhere. I won't make it. Don't play that. Don't bleed out now. Don't do it. Don't do it. We can possibly make it. I promise. Could we? Who is she talking to? Everyone else is like gone. Oh, board up. There you go. Really? Something occupy time, a guitar can brighten up our mood, especially if the person playing it knows what they're doing. Wow. Herbal gar garden, workshop. Look at all this stuff that could have saved us. Trap for small animals, there's food right there. Well, I might as well end the day. She can't do anything but sleep. You've been raided. Katia died. You didn't make it. <laughs> the timing. You survived for only 17 days. <laughs> I ate 21. My buddy got me some gin. Oh man. Plea for help. Our neighbors felt unsafe and asked us. We did that. I didn't mean to steal. I think that broke people down too. Despite his valiant struggle, Bruno didn't make it through the war. The fate of his friend he was worried about renowns unknown, remains unknown. Pavle decided to leave the shelter one fateful night. The next morning, he was shot in the back running from the bandits. Katia never found her parents, but they did find her grave one day with her war diary buried alongside. They published it without any alterations. It became a bestseller. Well, at least it was one happy story. GG. Well, that's a good playthrough. <laughs> Tomorrow night, I'm gonna do another one. Um. Ah, look at that. Oh, shoot. Uh-oh. I didn't mean to do that. Uh-oh. There's more people now, though. So that's pretty cool. Um, I didn't mean to do that though. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do end night either. No. Sleep. Get out of here. Leave. Yes. <laughs> that was an accident. Another try. So I just wanted to see Okay, so with these people, we survived 17 days. Then you have Pavle, Bruno, and Marco. Whoa, you can have four people there. I think we're going to do Bruno. Hmm. I think we'll do this one, actually. We'll do Pavle, Bruno, and Marco. Or should I do 